Evans and Fashionista here to bring you guys my week of favorites day two. So today we're going to be talking about my favorite deep conditioners and masks. If you know me, I love deep conditioners and masks. I'm so excited to talk to you guys about them. I love buying them. I love trying them. <laughs> so if you guys want to see the ones I've been buying, trying, and loving, then go ahead and stay tuned. If you haven't caught day one, go ahead, click the link down below or above, and go watch it. Then come back here, watch this one, and then make sure you watch tomorrow's video too because we're talking about leave-ins. And if you know me, deep conditioners, leave-ins, and oils, that's what I buy. That's that's what I buy. Like, I when I'm looking in the store, I, that's what I'm always looking for, a good leave-in, a good, good oil, a good deep conditioner. That's Those are my things. So make sure you don't miss those videos, okay? All right, let's get into this one. <laughs> so the first deep conditioner I want to share with you guys is this one. This is the Natural Mother's Naturals Matcha green tea and wild apple blossom nutrient rich hair mask or hair butter mask i love this mask because it makes my hair feel so revitalized my hair comes to life when i use this i don't care if i'm going through postpartum shedding i don't care if my hair is just feeling dull dry brittle like i don't care how my hair is feeling this is my end all be all one size fit all conditioner like I don't go without this conditioner when it gets halfway empty I buy a new one so this one is my ultimate favorite I really love it I just recently discovered it early 2019 I believe and I just I every three or four months I got I'm, I'm getting a new one because I love it so much and the natural mother's naturals not your mother's naturals um doesn't have any sulfates silicones parabens dyes you know stuff like that so this is pretty safe pretty good ingredients love it so much all right Next one I want to share with you guys is a remarkable product. I think it is really amazing. And that's the Main Choice um, Peach Black Tea and uh, Vitamin Fusion Anti-Shedding and Intense Volume Therapy Mask. Guys, this brought me through postpartum shedding. The second worst part of postpartum shedding besides losing your hair is the tangles, guys your hair tangles up at the root so bad so not only are you shedding but you have breakage from trying to detangle your hair and you can be as gentle as you want to and you still gonna be having some little tiny breakage pieces i still got breakage right up in y'all see this these little pieces of hair coming out of my braids this is this is from breakage from all that breakage my hair was breaking at the root when i had put half those part in shedding but once i discovered this this took my shedding down and it took my breakage down and it helped to detangle my hair i went from shedding this much hair i'll put a picture right here to shedding only this much hair back in that time and now i shed maybe half of this so this stuff is amazing it is not a super super duper thick one like if i turn it upside down like it'll start to come out a little bit but it's just like this perfect creamy slippery deep conditioner that i think is amazing and it brought me through guys i promise i use this from january all the way to march and i cannot say more good things about it you guys need to try it out and then a, a money saving tip is to check out marshall's and tj maxx for the main choice and shea moisture and some other brands because uh, this product, I think it retails for like $15, $16, and I got it for $12. So you don't get a huge discount off of the main choice at uh, TJ Maxx and Marshalls, but every safe coin count. Every safe penny counts. So definitely make sure you guys check out, uh, look for these at your Marshalls and TJ Maxx. So there's that. The next product I want to share with you guys are both uh, moisture protein balance uh, conditioners because I have high porosity here so I have to have a balance and back in the day I used to be able to do tea rinses and amla and you know henna uh, mask and deep uh, protein deep conditioners and then a regular deep conditioner like I used to, be able to do all of that but now I'm a mom and I do not have time to be spending an entire day on my hair I can get a good two hours in on my hair and then that's about it so I've been having to find conditioners that give me that protein and moisture and these two are the best now I feel like this one gives me a little bit more protein and this is the new texture by can to strengthen and restore moisture mass i feel like this really does it for me if i had to say like a ratio of how much protein how much moisture i would definitely say this is about a uh 60 40 60 percent protein 40 percent moisture so i definitely feel like it has a great balance and it gives me that good protein boost when my hair is feeling so too soft and mushy so but it def definitely doesn't give me like that crunchiness that you know hard feeling that most protein or yeah a lot of protein treatments give this definitely has a perfect balance this is my all-in-one hair repair mask i really really like this mask 
The next mask is the Shea Moisture Curl and Shine Hair Mask. Guys, I love this mask. I discovered this when it first came out, and I I really, really love this. I probably probably only purchased this once a year, um, but it's just so good. I really, really, if you like the Curl Enhancing Smoothie from this line, then you'll love this. This is like her sister. They're like, you know, if you like that one, you'll like this one. They're like twins. This is the deep conditioner version. It's stupid thick stupid moisturizing but it has a little hint of protein in it so like let's say i used this one like last week but my hair still feeling a little mushy but i don't need that much protein i go in with this one so it's really really good i think this has silk yes this has silk protein and neem oil in it so really love this one but it, yeah this one is more like 60 60 percent moisture 40 percent protein because it's just it's just a little bit more moisturizing than the other one all right so that is my well, my protein moisture balance ones um the next one i want to talk about are um the intense moisturizing conditioners now this one is an intense one this really is an intense moisturizing conditioner but this is more of my every week one like i use this one like more consistent this is like my ultimate but when i my hair is really dried out like for the winter these two that i'm going to talk to you guys about i don't have them on me but i'll put pictures right here um one is the uh shea moisture manuka honey and mafura oil everybody talks about that one it's really good you guys if you're in the natural community if you've been in the natural community for even a month you've heard about it <laughs> because everybody talks about it it's the name does not lie it is intensely moisturizing and if i use it too much i get moisture overload and i only use it in the winter when my hair is super duper dry so definitely check that one out if you have low porosity hair if you have a lot of dry rough ragged ends it just check that one out it's really good but for me i'm high porosity i cannot use that round year round because my hair will be a mushy mess okay <laughs> the next one i have to tell you guys about that i really love that's also intensely moisturizing is the honey miracle hair mask by tgin i love this one i feel like it is so moisturizing and it's deeply moisturizing like deep it's deep to moisturizing. All right let me tell you about this product when i rinse it out and I go to style my hair, I use less uh, leave-in and I use less oils because my hair feels so moisturized. Like I feel like it goes deep into that cortex and then it just grabs onto the hair and holds and locks the moisture in really well. So yeah, I, I feel like it's that's a really, really, really good moisturizing mask. I can't say enough great things about it. My hair just feels so silky, so soft, and so hydrated afterwards. But like I said, I, I have to use less product because it really is. And if I use that one too often, again, I will have moisture overload. So that's why I don't really, really keep it on deck unless I'm really in need of some moisture because it's it's really hydrating. <laughs> so the last um, the last category, even though I, have, I didn't start doing categories, but I feel like it's easier to keep it organized for you guys. The last category um, are my quick conditioners. Um, so the first one is the Aussie Moist. You guys know, Three Minute Miracle. Everybody talks about that one. That was really good. Um, I think it is super duper cheap, super duper thick, super duper moisturizing. My hair, if I need just a quick pick me up for my hair, I think it's really good. So make sure you check that one out. Um, if you don't care about, you know, if you're not an ingredient snob, check that one out. All right. Um, and then the last one, but not least, I really like this one because not only is it um, a quick mask on my hair, but it's also a clay mask. Um, so this is the African Pride Moisture Miracle Moroccan Clay and Shea Butter Detox and Soft and Heat Activated Mask. What I do with this mask is I put it on my hair, I wash my body, and then I rinse it out. I don't put a bag on my head, I don't do the heat, I don't step out of the shower with this on. This is one of my quick ones. Surprisingly, you would think, you know, it would be something that says it's a quick one, but this is a quick one. I feel like my hair is transformed when I rinse it out. I feel like my curls are popping. And my hair is really soft. My strands are really soft. My hair is moisturized. It's just a really good quickie for me. I really like this one a lot. And I just, it's really cheap. It's really cheap. I think it's like $6 for 16 ounces and you just can't beat this with a stick and it also has a little bit of protein in it too so i just feel like if i just need like a three minute miracle but the three minute miracle don't really have no protein in it i feel like this is it this is my 15 minute miracle <laughs> um, so yes i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you stay tuned for day three tomorrow i'll be talking about leave-in conditioners i love leave-in conditioners that is one of the products i spend the most of my money on so make sure you stay tuned and like i said if you haven't caught up go ahead and get caught up and i'll see you tomorrow bye Mwah.